There's lots of reasons why people with worry struggle to reach out for help. I think one of them is that worry in of itself doesn't feel like a weighty enough problem. It's, it, it, can't be, it can't be right. How can that just make sense of this visceral experience that I have? It just doesn't quite add up. Second might be that people worry about whether they'd be taken seriously um, or they might avoid approaching someone who might be able to help with their problem. So if we think about what we've spoken about, one of the behavioural um, experiences of some people who worry is they avoid trying to solve the problems because problems in themselves are dripping in uncertainty. So unsurprisingly, it makes it very hard for people who worry to come forward to face their problems. But worry has an enormous cost, um, both psychologically and emotionally and physically for us. It's a huge burden that we need not carry. And so I would ask you, you know, if you found some of this information helpful, if it's resonating with you, um, that if you think actually, uh, perhaps I do struggle with excessive worry, then please do reach out and seek help. So below this video, there's a number of places you can do that. Um, you can also approach your GP and have a conversation with them. You may want to take some notes from what you've heard on this video and anything that's resonated with you and take it uh, with you to your GP. Um, One of the things that my colleague and mentor and teacher, Professor Mark Freeston, said some years ago when we were thinking about worry is that worry should not be thought about as a personality trait. It's something we can understand, something we can change, and there's a very good evidence base for cognitive behavioural therapy in the treatment of worry. You will have heard me talk about my own experience and using mindfulness and uh, I hope you can see how a mindfulness practice uh, could also be a very helpful way of working with your worry. So um, again, I hope you found these videos helpful um, and uh, please uh, do um, send us some feedback about them if you so wish. Um, and if you are struggling with worry and uns unsure about whether you should approach someone for help, um, please do.